Hey everyone, it's EJ with Cryptography, where we unlock crypto for the masses. Today we're going to take a look at ZeroX, not Ox, or the Zero Exchange. And according to them, they are an open protocol that facilitates trustless, low friction exchange of Ethereum based assets. But what does that mean? Well, don't fret, it's actually one of the easiest coins to understand in the ecosystem right now. So let's take a step back and think about crypto. All these crazy ICOs and tokens that are being created right now really kind of contribute to this chaos. And in the future, by 2020, we could expect hundreds if not thousands of companies and assets being digitized on the blockchain. Now, that just creates kind of like this big web of in, that makes it really difficult to interact. And so what ZeroX is trying to do is they're trying to make it easy to go from one token to the next on the blockchain. Now, if you don't know what a token is, I would highly recommend pausing this video now and checking out our Tokens in Two Minutes video. Check out the link in the description. So yeah, ZeroX tries to describe themselves as an open public infrastructure, not an application, very important. And all that means is that there is sort of architecture or blueprint or just kind of rules of how you can go about exchanging from one token to another if you use their platform. And why should you care about this? Well, it's pretty simple. They're trying to go after the whole speed aspect of things, break down the speed and the cost. They want to make transaction from one token to another a lot faster. If you want to do that nowadays, you currently have to go through Kraken or Bitfinex, all these crazy exchanges that are really built around trading and speculating and really just making money, not about applications. Um, they're also trying to break down that cost because those exchanges have a lot of costs associated with them that make it really unprofitable or difficult for companies to start up and make their own project. So between those two things, they're really trying to foster the sort of speed of the Ethereum network and, and, and foster sort of partnership and, and, and camaraderie across different companies. And most importantly, something you should always look at when you're looking at these tokens, they have a great team. They've got engineers, computer scientists, and physicists working on developing the project with a really strong team of advisors from Coinbase, as well as Augur. And when is this all happening? Well, you can expect their sale to go live in late Q3 of 2017 where they're selling about 70% of their fixed supply. Yes, that's it. fixed supply, so there's no inflation, they're not creating any more um, within their crowd sale. As always, at Cryptography, we encourage an open discussion. Please like, subscribe, and comment below, and we'd love your support.